All right, everybody, welcome back to another ID Outdoors episode. Today, Dawson and I are fishing. Well, let me show you. It's a, it's a little flooded down here on this river that we're fishing. Um, so right now, we're just fishing some power bait. Um, last night, the water was already starting to go up. So I'll roll a little bit of a, a little bit of the clips of the two fish we caught right now. Hooked up, guys. Hooked up here. Oh man, it's so hard to fight these things in flooded water. I have no idea what I have. No idea at all. Oh, it's right here in front of me. Rainbow. It's a rainbow. Really nice fish. Wow. Was not not expect, expecting to catch a fish of this of this size. Dang, I barely have this thing hooked. If I'm grab it, I'm gonna lose it. Guys, serious West Virginia rainbow action there. Barely got him hooked. We're gonna get this thing off the hook here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Okay, he's gonna be all right. I gotta get the forceps in him. He's barely hooked in the corner of my mouth, but that, if you guys trout fish, that hook, that jaw can be a pain in the butt. Oh, he just, he got off. Pretty sweet. It's all right. Nice fish though, nice rainbow. Keep on, keep on fishing. It's flooded water, it's pretty tough to fight these things. But, keep on going. Oh my gosh. Got hooked up with a freaking stud. Oh my freaking gosh. That, oh, it just broke off. It just broke off. That was a stud of a rainbow. Oh, that sucks. So yeah, we caught those two fish last night. Ended up going uh, pretty uh, downhill because we were fishing with the, the rain. Uh, the rain was, it rained all day yesterday. We were able to fish some uh, different rivers and f uh, film some episodes, but the rain just was too bad. And it was really flooded this morning. So now it's starting to go down, but we're pickpocketing every little dead hole we can where we think there's trout in there. So you guys stay tuned. Hopefully we can catch some trout, show you guys how to fish really muddy high flooded water for trout so thank you guys for watching this channel stay tuned hopefully we can catch some trout and some of this ugly muddy water All right, guys, just caught this fish. Realized my GoPro wasn't on. Look at the colors on that fish. All right, spot number two. Uh, we're fishing a little bit of a dead hole out here and some dead hole down through there. So I'm just gonna throw this power bait in there. Not on top of that rock like I just did. And just kind of let it go down through here in the middle of really the high water. These trout are kind of get caught. Try to really lazy in this high water. They don't get they want to get washed away. They like all the rest of their friends underneath rocks. So yeah, we're just gonna ooh, we're just gonna play it by ear. Just kind of watch, see what happens. Guys, I'm hooked up. With a nice rainbow. Oh, it just got off. It was tangled up in Dawson's line. Wow. It's all right, but. I think we found a little pocket of them here, guys. Fishing with the four sinkers, fishing this uh, yellow power bait, and just kind of jigging it off the bottom, letting them pick them up as they're coming out of the rocks in this flooded water. So let's just talk about how we're kind of fishing this. The water is coming in over there. The water's coming in right here. So the water right behind the rock is really flat. So luckily we're fishing on a big old rock ourselves. So we're able to fish from above and cast in there and let it sink without any disturbance so ends up working out pretty well dustin and i have each pulled one out of here and we're gonna still keep on fishing it and there's some other holes like this that we're just gonna keep on fishing it and we're gonna catch some trout show you guys guys i think i'm hooked up i'm standing in this creek i think there's one on the other side of this rock i have hooked up 
Oh, damn it. I missed it. I missed it. I gotta get down there closer. I gotta get down there closer. Oh my gosh, guys, I just lost one. Right as I was turning on the camera, I lost it. That's so aggravating. Anyway, I'm fishing down here at the bottom end of the hole where Dawson was actually fishing and Dawson and I actually were fishing. And uh, I lost one. I thought I had a snag. My line stopped real, real fast. And uh, I lost, I thought I actually was gonna lose everything. I thought I was snagging and then it started bouncing. I was like, oh, that's definitely a fish. But had it almost all the way up to the water, but all the way top of the water, but dang. So I, I think there's probably more in here. I'm hooked up, I'm hooked up, I'm hooked up. Nice rainbow. Finally, I caught that fish I lost. Nice rainbow, gonna get him up here. Real nice fish, really good collars. Hook him in the top of the mouth. Easy to get out. That's what it's all about. All right, stop freaking out, stop freaking out, stop freaking out. They're good, they're good. Man, this water's freezing. Guys, look at that bow. Yes, yas. Very nice rainbow trout, beautiful fish. We're gonna get a release on this girl. Guys, I'm fishing these rainbows and stuff like that in the flooded water. You gotta have a little bit of movement to it because there's so much stuff floating down the river when it's flooded. God, fuck. Anyway, there's so much movement going down the water. You got to really jig it, make movement, make sure that fish can really see it. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> yeah, I just kind of dabbed there. But uh, anyway, you got to add a little bit of movement to it. Act, uh, act like that bait is actually alive, even though you're fishing power, but you got to act movement to it. The smell, there's so many things going down the river. You got to add just, just movement in these fishes. Demolish it. Guys, I'm going to try to fish this hole right here. After this, I think Dawson and I are going to be done for the day. So we're going to see what happens here. If nothing happens, I guess I'm gonna have to call it a day, but we'll just kind of just fish it and you know how we do. Everybody, this is gonna be this the end. This is going to be the end of this ID Outdoors episode. So thank you guys for watching this. We appreciate all of the support that you guys are giving us. Remember, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the post notifications. Follow us on Instagram, that'll be all be down in the description box. If you do Facebook, we have that too. So thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully it was a good one for you guys to watch. Learn some tips and trying to fish this high water, even if it's in the summer or the fall. Try to fish where the dead spots are. If you use power bait, uh, worms, they just don't really work so much because they just blend in with all the natural baits and everything else that's going down, going down the river so fast. So thank you guys for watching this episode. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.